street that I'd be living in North Carolina today. You couldn't have told me that I would go in the army for 26 years. You couldn't have told me that I'd become the man that I've become today. But God knew it all the while. So when we go through trying times, Lavanya got it right. The letter that she wrote Dave, even though she knew that her time was short and her steps were getting closer together, she got it right. And the only way you can defeat the trouble in this zip code, the only way you're going to get strength to fight it is from God. It doesn't come any other way. If you try to live in this zip code, uh, it's like to me every time I come, there's a dark cloud. There's nowhere to go. I saw people that I grew up with yesterday. They were not in their right mind. Those were not the kids I grew up with. They're not living the dreams they were telling me about. When we were in the same classroom, they were saying they were going to be firemen and policemen, and they're walking up and down Main Street. They're out of their mind. They're not themselves, and that's not what God wanted for them. God has spoken better of everyone. God has spoken higher of all of us. God has spoken about family. God has spoken about being together. You know, but there's a, there's a war going on out there. And you can't put your family together without the power of God. You can't get the, to the right position you're supposed to be in without the power of God. We're not even designed to wrestle with the power of evil. You need God on your side. So when you go to the places you're going to, when you get the job that makes you successful, when you find the right husband, when you find the right wife, when you find the right family, that's when you know that God is on your side because you look around and say, how did I make it? How did I come back from war? How did I come back from a second war? How did I come back from a third war? How is my wife a three-year survivor? How am I able to preach this gospel? How am I able to stand like a man? How am I able to take persecution? How am I able to claim victory in the face of death? How am I able to say yes? He's all right. If I ever say yes, he's been good. How? Because God is God all by himself. You ought to give him some praise. You ought to lift his name. You ought to worship him. You ought to seek him. You ought to trust him. Because he's God almighty all by himself. Even if he didn't do one more thing, it's all right with me. He's better than good. Like camel sheep. He's all right. He's all right. Somebody praise him and lift him in here. He's all right.